welcome back. Today we have the Toucan Security Light Camera. Now, if you guys haven't seen this, these types of products before with Toucan, they have some amazing stuff here. Um, if you guys are brand new to the channel, consider subscribing. If you guys are a returning subscriber, welcome back. Got some good stuff here for you. So, uh, Toucan, um, haven't touched these guys in a while, um, but they always have some really good stuff here. Um, Raider motion detection, smart, bright, 1200, it looks like 1200 LMs, lumens maybe? Um, IP56 weather resistant, it's going to be a full 1080p two-way talk, uh, instant life feed, instant notifications, night vision, it's got 110 decibel siren, wireless connection, it calls, it has a call 911 service, it's pretty good, pre-recorded messages, 24-hour surveillance, no hub required, access anywhere. So um, these things are really simple to set up. I've never had an issue with these guys when it comes to the setup process. So here we go, what do we get? Um, there is gonna be a sticker here. If you wanna put that on the on the windows or if you wanna have a stake out there. Um, a lot of people like to have that just so that way people know um, that you have some, some kind of security. So here's gonna be a long cable. Looks like this might be for power. And here is your power supply with another long cable. So I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken, you just get the one and the one, just depending on the distance, plug it in, and then it just extends the power, which is great. Now, some of the other things you do get, you will get some hooks here to like hold the cables, some stuff to, to mount the, the camera up. And they do have a mount. So here it is. Then it's pretty simple. You see the holes right there. You pretty much... Put this in the wall somewhere and then it's good to go now here this is what you're going to loosen up and then you should be able to move all this stuff around which is great and then just tighten it up and you should be good to go now here is the camera itself how big this guy is <laughs> it's pretty big now one of the things it says in the back it says do not force the antenna into a position or attempt to remove the antenna as it may cause damage to the device so the antenna you shouldn't be able to force it around too much it will move pretty steadily pretty good so you know just leave it there it sends that extra connection uh to your device so down here is going to be your power and then here is your set button and once you install it like once you put it in there then that's pretty much it so there you go if you have it here right here on the wall like this that's how it's going to point so i'm just going to put it right here on the side and we're going to set it up here so that way actually you guys could see it. <laughs> it's like right there. So there you go. Just made a sound. I'm going here to my app. Uh, and I'm going to the place. I'm going to show you guys right now what I'm doing. And if you go to the Play Store or if you go to your Apple Store, um, just type, type in Toucan Smart Home or Toucan App. And that's the one that you're going to get. So I already have it. So I'm just going to hit Enable. And then Update. Now for you, if you don't have it updated or if you don't have it, then you're going to want to download it. So now once you have it installed, go ahead and hit open. And then the first thing is going to ask you is to download, uh, to log in. And the first thing is going to ask you to log in. So I already did that. I already got myself logged in. If you don't have an account, just hit register. Now for here, it says if you want, uh, you have a free Toucan account. Here's what is included. Um, I could share the camera, 24 hours recording, and it has a couple st stuff here. So I just, I'm just going to hit OK. Um, use your location. You want to turn this on. Um, the reason why is because it wants to know where you're at um, and where the device is. So you're, you, you want you want the security camera to work properly. So make sure you turn it on. Also, it says here, allow Toucan to record audio while using the app. Hit while using the app. And that should be it. So, okay, here we go. We're going to click on up here, add a new device. And this is up here at the at the top, the second one over security light camera. We've done this one before, wireless outdoor camera. That one is great. Um, as you can see here, there's more products coming soon. So, okay, let's do the, the top second one, security light camera. And we're just gonna pick front porch. From here, you're gonna wanna connect your Wi-Fi, whatever it is, make sure you're on 2G and, you're, and you put in the proper password. Once you do, you want to make sure you hit allow to uh, to kind of find connect to and determine related positions of nearby devices. So make sure you do hit allow on that one. 
And then here it says press and hold the set button on the back of the camera for three seconds and start the connection. So let me hold that here. And it says when the blue light begins to flash, uh, release the button. When you hear the camera say this device is initializing, tap next. So here we go, one, 1,000, two, 1,000, three, 1,000. The device is initializing. So there we go, you guys see the flash right there? So I'm gonna hit next. Now it's setting up the camera. That easy, it's, it's that easy. Now, if for whatever reason it does fail, it says press and hold the setup button again and release it. Pretty much follow the steps. It says the connection here has timed out. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now and I'm going to hit try again. So just in case, I want to show you guys that troubleshooting issue just in case it does that. That's how you do it. Okay, so here we go. Finally got it all set up and it went through its process. I'm gonna do another troubleshooting video if you guys have any issues where it's not working whatsoever. So we're gonna hit done and here we go. Now, I might have to show my phone because sometimes it doesn't like to connect properly, but it tells you here a bunch of instructions on what to do, what not to do. Um, yeah, and it's pretty much it. Okay, so I got the camera here. Let me click on the camera and it has a two-way talking and there it is. So check it out. You could probably hear it right here. So pretty cool. Um, hello? There you go. So pretty nice how it picked it all up. Um, if you if I do turn on the alarm thing, it's going to be down here on the bottom far right. <laughs> there you go. That's what it does. Um, if I click the other one, it says, oh, these are pre-mated things here. Let me do the dog barking. <laughs> wow. Um, okay, so let's check the different um, to see how the delay is. And I'll show you guys here. That way you guys could see the difference. So one, two, three. So it's about a second delay. Um, not too bad. So everything is all here. If you go here to the bottom or to the middle with that little speaker if you turn that if you click on that it turns off all sound on this thing on the top right hand corner is that little gear icon um this has like your notifications time set light settings night vision motion detection uh motion zones led indicator emergency call network event it has like everything that you have even greetings auto greetings that's pretty cool so if you want to turn this one on it says hello who is it how can i help you dog barking um, stop we're calling the police like whatever it is no trespassing you're being recorded it's pretty cool so i know with some of them they have like a little whistling sound um this one you could set stuff up like that so it's pretty nice how it does that um let's see what else can we get off of this thing on the bottom it has like sos camera pictures um it has like a light minute light on for a minute so <laughs> there we go <laughs> freeze <laughs> Um, let me see. Do you want to turn it off? Yes. Turn that off, man. That was bright. And then if we back up, then we'll have like different options here. So you got your light up there. You could turn it off your setting. If you want to add more stuff, that'll be there at the top. You could do different events here. So if you click event, it shows you your calendar, everything that it's being recorded. Um, yeah, it's all there. Everything that you want to record, you could just click on it and then you should be able to replay it. You could save it right there. It has a pro version. Um, pretty cool. It's funny how I'm just staring at the thing here and it's like doing its thing. Um, and then of course it's giving me my notifications there of, of what, what's happening. When it comes to settings here, you can share the device. You could do all kinds of stuff here. You could admin, share devices, device update. This is gonna be all right there and how to do it. Um, device update, I usually like to check this just in case it says down here at the bottom, all your devices are up to date. So pretty cool, pretty sweet how this thing is. Let me know what you guys think. I try to get you guys here all the latest and greatest. Stay tuned because I will do a video. If it doesn't work, how to fix it so i'll show you guys how to do that um in a bit so yeah let me know what you guys think hope you guys appreciate today's episode try to get you guys here some pretty cool stuff and yeah with all that being said you guys take care take care of each other see you guys in the next one Yeah.